Don't you wish your waders were hot like mine? Don't you wish your waders were hot like mine? Don't you? Don't you? Don't you? Don't you? Good morning. Good morning. So today we're going trout fishing and uh, this is kind of a s annual thing for us. We grew up with it, but it's, our kids haven't. And it should be monthly in the summer, but it's annual right now. Right. It's anyway, we were going to go to Florence County, but we're changing our plans and we're going to go trout fishing in Wapaka County instead. I will give you a little rundown on the streams here. So we're in southwest Wapaka County, also southeast Portage County here. And what we're having to decide here is of these green lines here they're uh, trout one uh, i'm sorry class one trout streams because most of the big fish are going to be heading down towards the the uh the uh confluence yeah of, yeah yeah blah 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 blah, blah 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 oh gosh it's always so packed full of crap in here it's kind of hard to get around all right let's see tackle box little one big one So I've got uh, three or four poles here, yeah. but when we go to get Bryson's license, maybe we'll pick up another right. another fishing pole. I still have dried worms on all the hooks. Okay. Pretty just typical. Clip, just clip them off. Too big? I think it's fun. That yeah, it seems fine, okay. All right, so everybody's tried on their waders, and uh, it seems like we take way more stuff than normal people. What's in the box? Oh, your, your waiter. Uh, oh yeah, don't let me forget to get an extra fishing pole. Okay, extra fishing pole. I have, uh, that's the deep woods off there and I have another one in here that I stole out of your garage. So we got two things off. Love you. Love you. Come on bro, we're gonna be late. This trout ain't gonna wait all day. Oh. All right, here we go. There we go. Alrighty, where's Tanner? Hold on. Did you do that on purpose? No. <laughs> as soon as I reach and grab the handle, I'm like. Tch. Sorry. All right. Gas, ice, food. We have spent probably probably not a, a terrible hundred thousand dollars here yeah. over haven't we Bryson <laughs> maybe over the years Easy. I guarantee it you, you need any ice for anything else no <laughs> we stop here for every single trip uh, food gas odds and ends anyway Bryson is now uh, 17 and a half we have to get him a license I'm not used to buying licenses for my kids. All of a sudden, he's becoming a liability. Yeah, it's time to cut the cord. Time to cut <laughs> the cord. He can't the cord even is cut. He's got his earbuds in. <laughs> All right, so you need a license. I need fire starter and fishing pole. What do you he's need? Waiters? He's not coming in. No, I need a, a map. All right. Logging at Fleet Farm. This is uh, really popular with all the farmers and the hunters. They all follow my blog. Go to the right. I'm waiting for my brother to do something stupid and entertaining. He will do that for us. A fishing pole. I ought to be able to find one here. These are not the right kind. A real cheap one. I like the little closed face reels that, that the kids use. They're trouble free. 27 bucks, that's about right. Mm -hmm. We're close to leaving Appleton. Almost. Emmons Creek is a class one trout stream in southeast Portage County. Tanner, Bryson. Ready? We trout fish to be men, right? hoo -ah! Men, 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 Oh, what a bunch of dorks. That's better than being serious. Sorry, Tanner. Tanner's like, I'm not related to you guys. Oh, yes, you are. Yeah, you are. Same bloodline. 
So we're literally in rural, on a road called rural, in the middle of nowhere. In rural Wisconsin. <laughs> and we we're got, lost. We took a, we're lost. I navigated and I jigged when I should have jagged. And for that, I'm truly sorry. Nobody forgives you. All right, so we are actually back on track. It's gorgeous in here, it's gorgeous. It actually is. There's Regardless. trees. There's sun. <laughs> Air's fresh. Gonna be there's a little left there that we don't take, and then here when we get to a straight crossing, we are gonna take a left. Wherever don't go, it ain't try. Well, we're three hours in and we're not fishing yet, but... But we have scouted out some spots and we know the best place to go. We're here, Emmons Creek Wildlife this. Area. Is this your, uh... Yeah, better bring that. The sounds and smells of my childhood right here. He's all country boys and girls. Do you have bug spray? Yeah, we do. Okay. Oh my gosh, that's gonna get heavy. <laughs> Don't you wish your waders were hot like mine? Don't you wish your waders were hot like mine? Don't you? Don't you? Don't you? Don't you? Don't you wish your waders were hot like mine? Ah. Don't you? <laughs> uh, trout fishing with Jamie Voris. Don't you? Ooh. You know, it's, it's really tough when you get a wedgie in your waders. <laughs> those, those things are heavy duty, man. All right, so. Oh, my ankles. I can't tell you how many times I've tipped over worms, like nudged them over with my foot. Mm -hmm. I'm out trout fishing and I turn around and all of a sudden I realize all my worms are gone. Mm -hmm. okay. oh. Put those in your pocket. Cool. Hold your breath. There we go. Actually your sweatshirt's pretty thick. That should be good. All right, Mark, lead the way. I'm going to take the back. We're going to walk down this way about 125 feet. Watch this cable. Heading off down a trail that looks like it's had some traffic. And there's nothing better than being out in the uh, Wisconsin woods. This is how Jamie and I grew up. I was never a good trout fisherman, or a hunter for that matter, but I've spent thousands of hours doing it, and I enjoy it. Last time Jamie took us on a fishing trip, we went down looking for a uh, mysterious creek that was showing on the plat book as a class, class one trout stream. We walked for two hours and we never found it. So this could be the same, we don't know. Well, this, this doesn't look like anything. This just doesn't look like a trail at all. There's no, there's no easy way forward here. That's good, we don't want a trail. You know what, it looks like a tornado came through here. Yeah, it really does. The trunk is like ripped from top to bottom in half, yeah, see it? Yeah, absolutely. Up here too, there's some so that let's, are popped let's over go, here. Look at that. Yeah, yeah. Wow. All right, let's go. Let's go around this. All right. Because you're never gonna get through that. You're gonna go the same way you're going. Minute, right? Does anybody else's feet feel like they're a thousand pounds? No, no, but my knees feel like they are. Hey, Jamie, what was that song? Uh, oh. Give me your gather up, boys. Don't you wish my waders? We're gonna do a little number. Three, two, 
one, and go. Don't, Don't you wish your waiters were hot like mine? Don't you wish your waiters were hot like mine? Don't you? Don't, Don't you? <laughs> Don't right. you? We could get arrested for this. Huh? Okay, keep going. I'm pretty sure this is right there. Like one step below that's, delivery. That's how you get demonetized. I need to know. Yeah. Oh, Holy boy. cow. Boy. I mean, that's, that's some serious force that's right why. there. What is that? The tornado. That's the root system of a tree. The tornado just flipped it right over. Oh See, look, they're all yeah. over. There's another one right there. Look at the twist on this tree up here, Mark. Oh, that's insane, huh? All right, so here's the trout stream. There it is, guys. Oh, yeah. Okay, who wants to go left? Who wants to go right? Now, all these trout streams, the reason they hold trout and they reproduce is because they're fed by spring water. Spring water's cold and uh, keeps the temperatures right, the oxygen level right. You can see here's the spring coming in. Yep. And we're starting, if you look down, we're starting to sink because the springs are always... This is uh, why we wear weighted. Yeah, so Jamie and I grew up with tennis shoes in this crap. Gosh. But nowadays, we've graduated the waders. <laughs> All right. Ooh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> oh my God. You can't make this up. I don't want, I don't want to touch you. Hold on to this. Bryson, hold on to this. Yes. I got sloshed, man. Jeez, Jamie. All right. So, <laughs> oh, I don't, my winners don't go up this high. Oh, oh gosh. Mark is not any help. Oh my gosh. My wallet and everything else. Ooh. So, well, you That's sucked what... me into this. Why'd you do that? <laughs> and you your, your waiters cover your, your butt. Oh. That's why you want to keep the camera. Mine are only hip high. Jeez. What mud? This is st <laughs> not but a fan. I can't even get out. Oh, man. Okay, so you could die in here. I believe that. Oh, that, ladies and gentlemen, there you go. is a bog. I blame that one on Jamie. So leave the Jamie. He's up ahead of us now, already fishing. Uh, we're working our way through the tornado damage. Okay. Don't fall. All right. Won't fall. All right. Is there a way to know where we're at? This big, this big uh, blowover right here, I guess. Don't fall. <laughs> this is actually some good trout territory right here. Tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put the camera away and uh, get baited up and start getting some fish. Trout like these these holes where these rocks are. Anywhere that they have to hide and a little bit of deeper water to retreat to. That's what I always figure is a good spot. Uh, as soon as you get past that, it's not so bad. Bryce and I have been trudging through spring hole after spring hole, muck hole after muck hole. We decided to take a little detour, come up high here, and work our way down the stream a little bit. Water's too deep, it's coming up over the top of my waders. I really can't afford to fall with my backpack on. Bryson was kind of pointing out to me that he would much prefer to just fish out of a boat. And I can see why, certainly. You just kind of sneak through here. Okay. Oh yeah. The joys of trout fishing. For every step we go this way, we have to do another step back. Aha. Aha. We're onto something here. I see a clearing. Of course, probably where it's easier to walk is, is not as good for trout fishing. But at this point, I don't care. It's survival mode.
<laughs> Shit. What, do you, what do you mean you hate this? This is awesome. All right, I don't blame you. Come on, we can do it. Oh. Well, let's see what we have up. Ah, oh, jeez. Ah. Yeah. What? I put my face right in a cobweb. Yeah, I've hit like four of those. Things. Well, we've definitely become city slickers. All right. I'm okay with that. There's nothing wrong with being a city slicker. Man, where did this stream even go? I, I, I've been a city slicker my whole life. I haven't. Well, we're going to get up here and we're going to get our lines in the water again. And then we're going to. Well, no, no, then we got to head back to the rendezvous point. I want an easier section of the river to traverse. I bet you Jamie and Tanner are just coasting along and totally different topography because you never know what you're going to get if you don't know the creek. We could be in the stupid spot that everybody skips, right? Oh, here I can see it. I can see it. No, no, I really can. Yeah, we definitely passed it. If I had chest waders on, then I could just head right on down the stream. But with these swollen waters, it's up over the top of my boot. I can't do that. All right, maybe this is a great spot. Let's be careful. Why not? It's the only spot we got. So let's just creep up on here and fish it. Like an inch deep everywhere. No, it's quite deep. This looks like a good spot right here. All right. That one. Nice. Hey, is it big enough? Yeah, I think so. I don't know what the keeper limit is in here. Two feet. Not bad, right? First one. Bryson's working that same hole. Very good chance to be more than one trout in there. Keep working your line down there so you work the whole bank, more or less. So trout fishing is really in my opinion, a lot of it is, is tenacity and patience. You have to work hard. Um, it's not easy. And it's really a good thing to share with your kids. This is a nice spot here along the bank. And uh, everything in me wants to drop a line. But uh, I'm going to give this spot to him and see if he can't pull one out of here. So keep a light footstep because they they get under the bank, creep on up here. As you get closer, get a little more light. You get right about where I'm standing right here. I'm gonna trade your places. Get it out in the, right in the center there. Perfect, I'm gonna just let it drift down. There's gotta be travel on it. Just keep your hole kinda out as far as you can. Yeah. I just kinda tease it along. You can set it and slowly work it way, work it back up here probably. I'm gonna just work that bank a couple times, okay? I'm gonna go up on the other side of these logs to so work this a couple times. And if it's worth it, I'll call you over there. All right, so this was really hard to get to. I hope it was worth it. There's a uh, pretty good log jam here, which provides good cover. So I'm gonna try to fish that hole right in there and uh, and if I don't get one out of there, we're gonna head back and rendezvous with Jamie and Tanner. Yes. All right. All right, so that's another one. And I think that's, I think it's a keeper. Honestly, I'm not even sure. I didn't see the published size limit, but usually, usually anything over nine inches is good. And this is probably about nine inches. Let's see, there we go, like that, right? 
That's a $50 trout right there. <laughs> if you do the math. So on the way back, we stayed up away from the creek and kind of took a shortcut. But the problem with that is that the creek winds and curves and it's easy to miss where your spot is for rendezvous, which we did. But fortunately, we were able to yell back and forth and locate each other. So we only lost a little bit of time before meeting up again. We had so many blow downs and so many, I mean, just oh, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. on both sides. It was rough. Apparently nobody trout fishes anymore. There's no evidence of anybody walking back there. No, I saw a lot of fish, to be honest with you. All right, let's get those fish on ice. Yeah. So all that work, yeah. all that work, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty positive, we expelled more calories than we hey, gained. Hey, we're just getting started. All right, so we're heading on to the next spot. Sand Creek. Yeah, I don't want to switch creeks. So for the rest of the trip, the boys, they were done with it. They had too many mosquitoes, brambles, and so on. So they stayed in the truck while we fished. Um, Jamie fished all the culverts that we drove past, which is kind of his specialty and his favorite. All right. It's a chub. It's a chub. Yeah. Nice, man. Not huge, but it's helpful. And I finally got to fish in some water that was shallower and not up over the top of my waders. Yep. Uh, you got a handful. Yeah, a few. A few. It's a lot of work. A couple in there. That is a lot of work. Yeah, but it's cool. It's it fun. is cool. Yeah, it's definitely a pan full of fish. It'll feed about a half a baby <laughs> for part of a feeding. <laughs> but uh, uh, that's, that's a good way to put it. Got a couple. I mean, they're all real nice eaters, though. Oh yeah. Oh, those are good. That's good size. And amazingly, those are, that's yeah, good. yeah, amazingly, uh, I think we caught three of them right by the culvert. One, two. Well, I guess two of them right by the culverts and that. Yeah. That's all right, wrap, man. Let's get out of here. Yeah. All right, so guys, we uh, we made it. We had our fishing trip. What do you think? In, in a few words, what do you think of it? Mosquitoey. Mosquitoey. Yeah, I really? can't argue with that. Um, Hard. <laughs> it was extremely difficult to navigate today. Okay. Very yeah. difficult. Yeah. To anyway, here's a, here's a long story short. It was a good trip. We all had fun. The boys uh, they struggled. We struggled. But that's trout fishing, and we made it, and now we're at Roses in Wapaka, and this is officially the end of our trout fishing trip, and we are now going to rest and eat and drink. Especially eat. Yep, we're going to eat, yeah. We're going to eat. Right. Okay. Oh, right now. Yep. <laughs>